We're now going to look at using an AccuBall or AccuBalls for headaches and neck problems. These larger AccuBalls are actually better to use on the neck region normally. Um, and what I recommend you do with them is you actually take the ball, and I'll demonstrate. You'd be lying down on the ground. And what you do is actually move it up from the skull region up through here and down. 80% of headaches are neck related. The nerves from the top part of the neck actually leave from here and go up and over your head and they actually give you the headaches into the front part of your head or the skull region. And if you actually release up through this region and leave the ball there, or two balls, and then move them down and then into these muscles, two of the trapezius muscles on the tops of your shoulders, you can help with your headaches and release neck tension. So what you'd be doing is taking the ball moving it from here systematically down and then I'll demonstrate with one ball now you'd be moving it down into this region on the top part of your shoulder and upper back and releasing these trapezius muscles so you could either use one or two in those regions as well So with respect to using either an AccuBall or two big AccuBalls, you would actually take either one or both and place them on the skull region. So you could do it with the one like this, or you could do it with two like this, and you rest on them. And you can actually move them down. With respect to headaches, the nerves that leave your neck, the top two, come from the top two cervical vertebrae and they go around the bottom part of your skull. It's known as the occiput. So this is one region that you want to put them at to release things. And then you can actually move them down your neck and release it. If you, you want to use just one, you can actually move sideways like this and pressure your neck to release some of the muscle groups. And then even down into this region, the trapezius, because you want to get this as well to release things. If you wanted to go a bit further, you can release the front part of your neck by rolling on top of the acuball as well. So you can rest them for a minute or two or as long as you want in different spots. I just demonstrated with the big ball to use on the neck region, but some people do prefer to use the smaller one on the back of the skull and neck area. So if you want to give it a try and see if you prefer the smaller one versus the bigger one. So you take the ball or balls and you place them underneath your skull here and right on the skull region and you can rest on it. So if you only have one ball, you can do it with one. Oh, Abby's head. Sorry. <laughs>